Tips. Are you ready to be entertained? Time for the Entertain Minute with Chris Green on K92.7. And your Entertain Minute on this Wednesday morning, Usher. I told you he got injured in Las Vegas. Well, he really got injured the other night as a fan kicked him in the face. He got kicked in the face by a fan. You know, he does this little set where he seduces a young lady, brings her up on stage. He was singing trade in places. And when the woman tried to turn around and lift her leg over his head, she kicked him in the face with her stiletto boot but he's all right alicia keys and george clooney they have a new global peace initiative entitled we want peace for peace over there in sudan they're always doing great work teddy riley this is quincy jones says that um quincy jones can't hear so how could he hear uh, the vocals on michael jackson's new album michael he doesn't like that album being put out Quincy Jones, that is, and Teddy Riley says that Quincy Jones can't even hear you talk, much less know that it's Michael Jackson's voice. Wow. Elder Barge is going to be on next week's cover of Jet Magazine talking about his 22-year addiction to drugs and his 12 kids. I didn't know he had so many kids. Freddie Jackson. Freddie Jackson was on the Soul Train Awards, and uh, everybody was saying how slim he looked, and rumors started swirling that he has AIDS or got a kidney problem. He said... Why can't a black man just lose weight without having AIDS or having a kidney infection? He's like, I went on a diet. That's why I'm slim. Well, good for you. A gaming company wants to create a game surrounding Wesley Snipes where users will try to get Wesley Snipes out of jail. And uh, George Clinton is suing the Black Eyed Peas for a sample that they did of Knee Deep in their 2003 song, Shut Up. And this has been your entertainment. Up next, it is the Old School Drive-Thru Lunch Mix, K92.7.